Monday Night Raw homecoming at Madison Square Garden last week. We come to you from Albany, New York for yet another exciting edition of Monday Night Raw on the road to January 1st, 2023 at the Royal Rumble in Toronto. Hello again, everybody, and welcome to Monday Night Raw and in your main event tonight. All day, Austin Theory looks to bounce back after his loss to Randy Orton at homecoming last week as he's set to go one-on-one -on -one with the phenomenal AJ Styles, a matchup that could have huge implications for the next number one contender for the WWE Championship. We kick off Raw tonight from Albany, New York, with a man who made his return a number of weeks ago in the WWE Draft, Johnny Gargano. A former NXT Grand Slam champion, now a part of the red brand and looking to make a name for himself here on the WWE main roster. As we approach the Royal Rumble, every man's looking to throw his name in the hat on that 30-man Royal Rumble matchup. The following contest is scheduled for one fall, making his way to the ring from Cleveland, Ohio. Weighing in at 199 pounds, Johnny Gargano. Johnny Gargano making his WWE return after an 11th month hiatus a number of weeks ago on Raw the night of the WWE draft. In the midst of that return, he defeated Mustafa Ali, who is now a part of Friday Night SmackDown, actually just won the United States Championship at the SmackDown All-Star kickoff this past week. But Johnny Gargano was successful in his return to Monday Night Raw, officially a part of the red brand each and every Monday night. And as we mentioned, the 30-man Royal Rumble matchup approaching on January the 1st, 2023. Every man's going to be looking to build momentum for that 30-man battle royal. And of course, the winner of that matchup is going to WrestleMania to challenge for either the WWE or World Heavyweight Championship. I'm sure we're going to figure out the field of the 30-man Royal Rumble matchup in the coming weeks. But as for tonight, Johnny Gargano has got his hands full with a former NXT United Kingdom champion, another man who was drafted to the red brand a number of weeks ago, the invincible Ilya Dragunov. This is going to be a good one, kicking us off in Albany, New York, tonight on Raw. And his opponent from Moscow, Russia, weighing in at 187 pounds, Ilya Dragunov. So a battle of two former NXT champions opening us up tonight. Ilya Dragunov was, of course, the man who dethroned the longest reigning NXT United Kingdom champion, Walter a man who just made his SmackDown debut this past week as well. Walter held that championship for 870 days, but who was his kryptonite? That was this man, the invincible Ilya Dragunov. So former NXT United Kingdom champion in his third matchup here on the main roster. So far, Dragunov is coming up on the short side of things. The loss to Sheamus, a loss to Tommaso Ciampa in recent months, but a new leash on life here on Monday Night Raw and Johnny Gargano set to contest across the ring. It's going to be a great matchup to kick us off here in Albany, New York on Monday Night Raw. And tonight that'll feature Austin Theory, AJ Styles, one-on-one. -on -one. Both those men looking to build momentum towards the Royal Rumble. How both of those men quite possibly could be next in line to challenge Randy Orton for the WWE Championship. Sunday night, January the 1st, 2023. The Royal Rumble's coming to Toronto, Ontario, Canada. Can't wait to get there, but let's focus in on the matchup at hand. Johnny Gargano, Ilya Dragunov kicking us off on Monday Night Raw. And of course, last week was Monday Night Raw homecoming from New York City, Madison Square Garden. What a night it was. The replay is available right now on the No Nation Gaming YouTube channel. Night like that featured Austin Theory versus Randy Orton for the WWE Championship. And what was one hell of a main event. We saw what was quite possibly one of the tag team matches of the year. And the Viking Raiders took on Damian Priest and Dominic Dijakovic for the World Tag Team Championships. Of course, we kicked off Raw Homecoming with a new Intercontinental Champion being crowned. Pete Dunne walking away that triple threat against Tommaso Ciampa and Sheamus holding the gold for the second time in his WWE career. Gargano taking the fight to Dragunov so far in this matchup. 
Uh, so last week at Raw Homecoming, we saw the in-ring returns of Big E and Kevin Owens as those two men went one-on-one. -on -one. What about two exciting matches from the women's division as Shotzi defended the women's championship of the WWE against the Nightmare Rhea Ripley. And the women's tag team championships were defended against Candice LeRae and Indy Hartwell against Alexa Bliss and Liv Morgan. It was an awesome night. A pay-per-view like Monday Night Raw. The replay is available now. Raw Homecoming from Madison Square Garden. Look at Dragunov here. Fireman's carry position goes down with him. Dragunov trying to get back in this matchup. It's been all Gargano since the opening bell. Let's focus in on this matchup, man. This is a very interesting contest, as we mentioned, with the Royal Rumble approaching. Every man on the Raw and SmackDown roster is looking to build momentum towards a 30-man fray, where the winner will main event WrestleMania for either the WWE or World Heavyweight Championships. Dragging off into the cover on Gargano here. Gargano gets his shoulder up. Johnny looking to keep that momentum going since his WWE return a number of weeks ago. Looking to go 2-0 here on Monday Night Raw. Dragging off, trying to break his bad luck as of late. 0-2 so far since debuting on the main roster a number of months ago. Can he get the win over Johnny Wrestling here tonight in Albany, New York? Again, still to come tonight, Austin Theory, the man who unfortunately for him came up short against Randy Orton for the WWE Championship last week. Is set to go one-on-one -on -one with the phenomenal AJ Styles. Those two men with a little bit of beef coming out of the fatal four-way matchup two weeks ago here on Monday Night Raw that was to crown the number one contender for the WWE Championship at Raw Homecoming. Looking to settle the score tonight. Both men looking, of course, not only towards the Royal Rumble, but to be quite possibly the next man to challenge Randy Orton for the WWE Championship. Possibly at the Royal Rumble event. And Gargano off the top rope, Hurricane Rana. Not enough to put Dragon off away just yet. You know, you might not like Johnny Gargano's attitude, the way he carries himself, that cocky attitude that Gargano has each and every time we see him in the ring. But at the end of the day, you cannot knock the abilities of Johnny Wrestling. There is a reason he is an NXT Grand Slam champion. NXT champion, North American champion, tag team champion of the black and gold brand. Of course, many moments and matches of the year for Johnny Wrestling down at NXT as well. But right now, Dragunov doesn't care about the past. He's looking for the future. Double close lines in the corner. And is that going to do it? But Gargano gets the shoulder off. Dragunov not, away, not able to put Johnny Wrestling away just yet. Former NXT United Kingdom champion looking to get that W here tonight on Raw. Could be looking for that signature uppercut. Gargano's dazed, but Johnny sidesteps it. That could have been the final blow in this matchup, but Johnny Wrestling had it scouted here. Missed with a drop kick, nails it the second time. Dragunov has really struggling to piece together some offense in this opening matchup. The majority of this bout has been Johnny Wrestling in control. As he sends Dragunov to the outside, I'm sure Johnny Gargano wouldn't mind a count out victory. A W's a W, whether you like it or not, especially this time of year with the Royal Rumble approaching, the road to WrestleMania approaching. Everybody's looking to build momentum. More W's equal more main events, more W's equal more championship opportunities. Wins and losses matter around these parts, as we always mention. So nobody looking to come up short here tonight in Albany, New York. And dragging off nice Saida there into the bridge, but with a back suplex, but Gargano. Too close to the ropes there. Look at that impressive maneuver by Dragunov. In and out the ropes. Follows it up with a clothesline. As we mentioned, Dragunov really struggling to piece together some offense. But can this do it? Will that be a knockout blow? But Johnny Gargano still has got fight left in him. And that's got to be credit to the fact that Dragunov really hasn't been in control from moment after moment in this matchup. Really spotty offense from the invincible one in this matchup. Since Gargano to the outside, Dragunov's gonna meet him there, but Gargano had it scouted and throws Jeremy, or excuse me, throws Ilya Dragunov into the barricade. Just like that, the momentum shifts back into the corner of Johnny Wrestling, whether you like him or not, whether you like the attitude or not. Johnny Gargano, for the most part, is wrestling his style of matchup right now against Ilya Dragunov. What a matchup we're seeing at the end of the day. Two incredible athletes inside of the squared circle. Two legends of the NXT brand. Now here on Monday Night Raw, they're going to make a name for himself on the biggest stage there is. 
Let's see what Johnny Gargano's got left in the toolbox here. Will Ilya Dragunov be able to get back into this matchup? And just like that sends Gargano back out to the outside of the ring. And the Invincible One trying to rally here in Albany, New York tonight. This is the kind of matchup that the champions of the Monday Night Raw roster got to keep their eye on. Randy Orton, the Intercontinental Champion, Pete Dunne. These are two up-and-coming talents on the Raw brand. Two veterans of the ring, but newcomers to Raw. And quite possibly two future contenders for several of the Raw championships. Gargano, look at that, just like that, back in control. Wait a minute, drop toe hold here. Oh no, Dragunov's in trouble. Johnny Gargano locking in. The Gargano escape on the invincible one here. And Dragunov's got nowhere to go. A tap out in the middle of the ring. And Johnny Gargano moves into 2-0 since returning to the WWE and becoming a member of Monday Night Raw. This matchup was Johnny Gargano in control for the far majority of it. Dragunov really struggling to get offense here in. Spotty offense from the Invincible One. He gave it his all, but Johnny Wrestling just had a strategy, stuck to it. And at the end of the day, like Gargano or not, was simply the better man here tonight in Albany, New York. Well, Gargano picks up a win with the Royal Rumble approaching on January 1st. We could be looking at one of the 15 Raw superstars that will enter the 30-man fray. Could Johnny Gargano be the one heading to WrestleMania? We are back live on Monday Night Raw from Albany, New York, in the modern-day Maharaja. Jinder Mahal set for a one-on-one -on -one action here on Monday Night Raw. And still to come tonight, as we've mentioned all day, Austin Theory set to go one-on-one -on -one with the phenomenal AJ Styles in a matchup that could have huge implications on the next number one contender for the WWE Championship heading towards the Royal Rumble. But Jinder Mahal's got his hands full tonight with the original bro. Matt Riddle set for action here in Albany. This is going to be a good one. Riddle Mahal right now. And his opponent from Las Vegas, Nevada, weighing in at 216 pounds. Riddle. Well, you know, we've questioned if Matt Riddle's been the same man since Randy Orton turned his back on him a number of months ago. But over the last number of weeks, we've witnessed Riddle cap off a rivalry with the Nigerian giant, the Colossal Omas, in a no-holds-barred matchup, which he tapped out the big man in that contest. Of course, Riddle was a member of that fatal four-way number one contenders matchup a number of weeks ago. May have came up short. Luckily for Riddle, his shoulders weren't the ones pinned to the mat, so a little less sour in defeat. Let's we'll see if Riddle can keep the momentum going off that matchup with Omos a number of weeks ago here on Monday Night Raw. The original bro, Jinder Mahal, set for action here. In Albany, New York, and Riddle running at Mahal with the knee. And that could be also your own knockout blow right off the get-go here. Into the cover he goes, Mahal, and we get the shoulder up. Can't take Jinder Mahal lightly, a former WWE champion, a former United States champion. Most recently here in the WWE, we're dating back a couple months, but was the number one contender for the Intercontinental Championship. These may not have been going Jinder Mahal's way as of late, but back in action here tonight, a part of Monday Night Raw due to the draft a number of weeks ago, and has got his hands full with Matt Riddle. It should be a very competitive contest, but the modern-day Maharaja's got to get back into this because it's been all Riddle since the bell sounded. Nice Insiguri kick. Quite possibly could be looking at two of the 15 Raw superstars that will enter the Royal Rumble matchup. 15 from Raw, 15 from SmackDown. Only one man can go to WrestleMania. We're going to find that out on Sunday night, January the 1st. It will be a live premiere right here on the No Nation Gaming YouTube channel. 5 p.m. Eastern time. The road to WrestleMania kicks off in Toronto at Royal Rumble. We're unloading on Jinder Mahal right now. Another kick. The majority Matt Riddle, the last minute or so since the bell sounded in this matchup, and another knee. I don't know how many of those Jinder Mahal can take. The bare knees of Riddle to the chrome dome, and Mahal gets the shoulder up. 
Ender trying to fight here, but Riddle's just been all over him since the opening bell. The original bro is coming out motivated tonight. We just talked about moments ago how much wins and losses matter around here, especially when it comes to championship opportunities. Both these men know that well, and, and you got to think Riddle, a number of months ago when things imploded with Randy Orton, Orton promised he would never step foot in the ring with Matt Riddle again, and after Extreme Rules, you know, surprisingly, Matt Riddle obliged. We haven't seen Riddle and Orton anywhere near each other since, but it's a very interesting scenario. Randy Orton's the WWE Champion right now. If Riddle finds a way to become the number one contender, quite possibly through the Royal Rumble matchup, he could finally get another chance at Randy Orton. All remains to be seen. It's obviously no easy task winning the Royal Rumble matchup. But right now, Riddle's focused on Jinder Mahal and Jinder Mahal only. Senton off the apron, and the original bro is putting on a showcase tonight in Albany, New York. What a matchup here so far tonight on Monday Night Raw. What a matchup we just witnessed between Johnny Gargano and Ilya Dragunov as Riddle again is unloading on Jinder Mahal. The former WWE Champion has got no answer for a former Tag Team Champion here in the WWE. Another kick to the side of the head. Oh, Riddle's going behind. I think he might be going for that submission hold. The same submission that tapped out the Nigerian Giant a number of weeks ago here on Monday Night Raw. And Mahal taps out. Matt Riddle picking up yet another victory. An impressive faction here on Monday Night Raw. Jim Mahal, little to no offense in this contest. I mean, Riddle, you want to talk about being motivated absolutely putting on a showcase Here tonight winner, another victory for the original bro and as we mentioned are we looking at one of the 15 men that are going to be representing raw in the 30-man royal rumble matchup january the 1st 2023 30-man enter one man will leave with a first class ticket to wrestlemania Well, the action continues here tonight on Monday Night Raw. The Empress up tomorrow. Asuka set the battle Nikki Cross, and the undefeated Karrion Cross meets R-Truth in the middle of the ring. And the Empress up tomorrow, picking up another W for a first matchup since losing the championship at Survivor Series, and Karrion Cross moves to 4-0. We're back live inside Albany, New York, and we are set for a little women's division action. Ladies and gentlemen, we want to remind you that coming up on December the 21st, 5 p.m. Eastern Time, it is a live premiere event, a special Raw and SmackDown joint production of Saturday night's main event. A special event coming your way December the 21st. And then, of course, we've been talking about it all night long. Sunday night, January 1st, 2023, the road to WrestleMania begins in Toronto at the Royal Rumble. Live premiere, 5 p.m. Eastern time. We're kicking off the new year in the best way we know possible. Well, let's focus in on a little bit of women's division action tonight. Mia Yim set to battle it out with the glow. Naomi here on Raw. And accompanied by Sasha Banks from Orlando, Florida. Naomi. And as Naomi makes her way to the ring, the women's champion Shotzi was successful last week at Raw Homecoming against the Nightmare Rhea Ripley. But Shotzi, a defending champion, looks to put her championship on the line yet again. Next week on Monday Night Raw, it is an open challenge for the WWE Women's Championship. Shotzi puts the gold on the line. Who is going to answer the open contract? We're going to find out next Monday night on Monday Night Raw. And could it very well be one of these women, Naomi, Mia Yim. An exciting women's division contest rolling us on here in Albany, New York on Raw tonight. And of course, the ball, Sasha Banks in the corner of her tag team partner. You never know, Naomi and Sasha Banks could be looking at Candice LeRae and Indy Hartwell, the current WWE Women's Tag Team Champions. All remains to be seen who's going to be next in line for all the championships in the women's division as we roll towards the Royal Rumble, as we roll towards Saturday night's main event on December the 21st, and of course, as we roll towards WrestleMania. Mia Yim, one of the toughest SOBs in the women's division. We've seen her hang in there with the best of them, especially down in her run in NXT. Make a name for herself on the main roster again, Naomi, in her own right. 
former women's champion, as well as her and Sasha Banks, former women's tag team champions. I'm sure both of those ladies would love to get the gold around their waist again. Let's see who can pick up the W here. Nia yeah, Yim trying to make a name for himself, make a name for herself, as we mentioned, you know, Monday Night Raw. And a win over a former champion and a future Hall of Famer in Naomi could ju do just that. What breaking news we just saw moments ago. Shotzi, who won the Women's Championship back on Thanksgiving night at Survivor Series, dethroning the Empress of Tomorrow, Asuka. Of course, Asuka held the championship from June 26th all the way to Thanksgiving night of this year. Shotzi won the gold against Asuka. And of course, moved into Raw Homecoming in MSG last week, retaining the gold over the Nightmare Rhea Ripley. But Shotzi looking to be a defending champion has issued that open challenge, an open contract for the Women's Championship next week on Monday Night Raw. Who's going to be the lady to put pen to paper and meet Shotzi in the middle of the ring next week? We'll find that out in the next edition of Monday Night Raw when the Women's Championship is on the line. But right now we got Naomi and Mia Yim. As Mia Yim, look at the strength, power bomb to Naomi. And smart to go directly into the cover here, not just yet. But more offense like that, Mia Yim's going to be getting her hand raised tonight in Albany. And still to come tonight in your main event, all day Austin Theory set to go one on one with the phenomenal AJ Styles. It'll be a great matchup there. A little bit of a grudge contest, if you will, coming out of that fatal four way matchup a number of weeks ago. Can't wait to get to our main event in moments. What a great night it's been here so far. Johnny Gargano with the win over Ilya Dragunov. Matt Riddle with the win over Jinder Mahal. Asuka returning for the first time since Survivor Series. Defeats Nikki Cross. And Karrion Cross continuing to stay undefeated with a win over R-Truth. Now we have Naomi and Mia Yim battling it out inside the squared circle. Naomi trying to get back in this contest. Nice back suplex on her opposer here tonight. Falls it up the neck breaker. Naomi looking good here tonight in Albany. And for the women's division, both Shotzi and, of course, the tag team champions, Candice LeRae and Indy Hartwell, got their eyes locked on this contest. We'll find out next week who Shotzi's going to be defending the women's championship against. But after Candice LeRae and Indy Hartwell defeated Alexa Bliss and Liv Morgan last week to retain their women's tag team championships, they're going to be looking for new number one contenders, possibly heading towards the Royal Rumble. We'll find out who's going to be next in line to challenge the way in the near future. Naomi's taking the fight to Mia Yim right now. Of course, don't forget, as we just mentioned, Saturday night's main event making its return. A joint Raw and SmackDown production will be a live premiere on December 21st at 5 p.m. Eastern time. Should be a great night of action. Remember the last time Saturday night's main event had it in here. We had Edge versus John Cena battling out. And the main event that was the night in that old rivalry. John Cena picked up the win on that night. That was, of course, back in the month of August. Saturday night's main event will be back on December the 21st on the road to the Royal Rumble. Mia Yim trying to get back in this contest. Naomi having none of it there. Splits the legs. And now going to the top rope. Naomi, one of the most versatile athletes in the women's division. The agility of this woman always impresses inside the squared circle. Meteora from the top rope. And Mia Yim's put up a fight in this contest. But her days could be numbered. Look at this sunset flip. Oh, wait a minute. Going for a submission hold here. It's been a submission city night here at Albany. And Mia Yim keeps it going. A tap out in this women's division contest. Impressive fight in this women's division matchup. Mia Yim giving it her all, but in the end, Naomi picking up the W inside the squared circle. Mia Yim coming face to face with Naomi right now. And a sign of respect between these two incredible athletes, but tonight belongs to Naomi. Well, coming up next week on Monday Night Raw, as we found out, the women's champion Shotzi issues an open challenge to the locker room. Who's going to sign that open contract and meet Shotzi for the women's championship next week? And also kicking off next week, it is a World Tag Team Championship Eliminator. The winners fight Dominic Dijakovic and Damian Priest at the Royal Rumble next week. 
DIY. Gargano and Champa are back to battle the New Day. And in two weeks, the Viking Raiders take on Jinder Mahal and Sheamus. Who's going to the Royal Rumble? But it is main event time here tonight in Albany. And the phenomenal AJ Styles, who's been looking to climb back into the top contender rankings for the WWE Championship the last number of months. A win tonight could absolutely put him next in line for the Apex Predator, Randy Orton. But he's got his hands full with Theory, who's walking away with the W tonight on Raw. The following contest is scheduled for one fall making his way to the ring from Gainesville, Georgia, weighing in at 218 pounds, the phenomenal AJ Styles. AJ Styles drafted the Monday Night Raw a number of weeks ago, and then you remember back at Survivor Series on Thanksgiving night, Styles along with Priest and Dijakovic putting their issues with the Hurt Business behind him with that six-man tag team win at Survivor Series. AJ came up short in the number one contender's fatal four-way two weeks ago. Of course, he wasn't the one pinned in that matchup, but Austin Theory was the one that walked away with the victory. Austin Theory may have came up short to Randy Orton last week at Raw Homecoming. A little roll-up counter by the Apex Predator. Orton, sneaky and slimy inside of that ring, was able to sneak away with the victory to the Viper. So Austin Theory looking to bounce back tonight against the phenomenal AJ Styles. Big fight feel here tonight in Albany, and I'm sure the WWE Champion, Randy Orton, is cozied up and ready to watch this matchup in the locker room. Theory versus AJ Styles, one-on-one. -on -one. And his opponent from Atlanta, Georgia, weighing in at 220 pounds, Austin Theory. Austin Theory, a former WWE Champion in his own right, only held the championship for about a month here. Won it back on August the 7th at Extreme Rules, lost it on September the 10th at Judgment Day. Austin Theory just getting done a multiple month battle with John Cena, came up short in that rivalry at Survivor Series in the last man standing matchup. Things seem to be going good for Theory when he won that number one contenders matchup, but falls right back down the rankings with that loss to Orton last week. So Theory looking to bounce back. AJ Styles just looking to climb the ladder of contention. A lot riding on this matchup when it comes to who's going to be the next number one contender. Maybe an unofficial number one contenders match, but you're looking at two of the top stars on Monday Night Raw and two people who would love to get their hands on Randy Orton. So we are underway with tonight's main event, AJ Styles versus Austin Theory. And as you just saw, coming up next week on Monday Night Raw, a World Tag Team Championship Eliminator is gonna kick off over the next number of weeks with the winners challenging Damian Priest and Dominic Dijakovic for the WWE World Tag Team Championships in Toronto on January 1st at the Royal Rumble. Next week, Johnny Gargano and Tommaso Ciampa, DIY is back together here on Monday Night Raw. We're gonna have to hear from those two men regarding that situation, reuniting DIY, but they're gonna be back in the ring together to take on Kofi Kingston and Xavier Woods of the New Day. And then in two weeks time on Monday Night Raw, Eric and Ivar, the Viking Raiders, will battle it out with the buddies, Jinder Mahal and Sheamus. And the winners of those two matches will fight in the finals of the Eliminator. The winners of that goes on to the Rumble. Very exciting situation regarding the World Tag Team Championships. Focusing in on Austin Theory and AJ Styles right now. Theory really pushed Randy Orton to the limit last week. Almost walked away at Madison Square Garden, the new WWE Champion. Austin Theory, remember at the closing moments of the matchup, and was able to avoid the RKO. Had Randy Orton up in a bit of a powerbomb position. Orton was able to sunset flip out of it, catch Austin Theory into a pinfall, and snuck away with the victory. I'm sure that has been eaten alive, Austin Theory, the last seven days, but at the end of the day, Got to move on to the next matchup. And try to get the W here. No easy task in front of him. Former multiple time WWE Champion and AJ Styles into the cover goes Theory and Styles will get the shoulder up. Of course, AJ Styles' most recent WWE Championship run was from April the 11th to June the 26th of this year. Defeated Bobby Lashley back at Backlash, which really kicked off a several month issue with the Hurt Business. 
And they lost that championship to the rated R superstar Edge back at SummerSlam. AJ's been chomping at the bit to get back the WWE Championship ever since. The Hurt Business issue really sidetracked Styles focus. Now with Bobby Lashley off to SmackDown, the Hurt Business really imploding in the WWE draft a number of weeks ago. Styles putting those issues behind him. He's got a new resound focused. And possibly being next in line to become WWE Champion. And Styles crashing and burning off that knee there. Austin Theory looking to get back into this matchup. Dragged on the phenomenal one around the ring. And Austin Theory ever so impressive with that shooting star press. You may not like his attitude, you may not like his big ego, but no one can knock the hustle of Austin Theory inside of that ring. I went up AJ Styles again, but Styles had a counter that time. AJ right back into this contest, really back and forth since the opening bell, and Styles gets that knee he was looking for a few moments ago. Oh no, Springboard moonsault there and lands it on Austin Theory on the lower back. You notice Theory was trying to get out of the way there, but incidentally took that maneuver to the lower back position. Not enough to put Theory away yet, but the damage certainly done by the phenomenal AJ Styles. Of course, Rob Van Dam was the fourth participant in that fatal four-way matchup two weeks ago here on Monday Night Raw. He was the one who Austin Theory pinned in that contest. RVD wasn't in action last week, wasn't in action this week, but I'm sure Mr. Monday Night, the whole damn show, is chomping at the bit to get back inside the squared circle, and I'm sure he's chomping at the bit to get his hands on Austin Theory. AJ off the frog splash into the cover. Theory gets the shoulder up. Very interesting matchup right now. You see both men really haven't gone for the kill just yet. It's been back and forth the majority of this contest. Austin Theory, wait a minute, whips AJ Styles off in the corner. Oh no, I think we know what's coming here all day. Blockbuster by Austin Theory. And that could be all she wrote in this main event contest on Raw, but AJ Styles gets the shoulder up. Signature maneuver by Austin Theory, a maneuver that almost won him the WWE Championship last week in Madison Square Garden. And Styles, you smell the sense of urgency after that blockbuster, trying to take the fight to Theory, but Theory not allowing it off the snap suplex. You have watched the evolution. Oh, wait a minute, wait a minute. He's got AJ all tied up. And AJ Styles may be looking up at the lights here in New York. No! Living to fight another moment. Theory throwing some of his best shots at the phenomenal AJ Styles, but Styles continuing to fight in your main event contest tonight. And as we are about to mention, we've really witnessed, wait a minute, again, AJ Styles here. Small package, but Theory gets the shoulder up. We've really witnessed the evolution of Austin Theory throughout this year. With his rivalry with John Cena with his run as the WWE Champion. Theory has absolutely made his way and earned his spot in the main event picture here on Monday Night Raw. Nobody can deny that, nobody can deny his talents. He's gotta get the job done inside the squared circle. Styles back into the matchup, forearm to the outside. And the former multiple time WWE Champion AJ Styles looking to make sure Austin Theory isn't building momentum off his behalf. And sends him into the steel steps on the outside of the ring. And think this is where things really start to break down. On the outside, got with the brawl ensue. Austin Theory wants none of it now. But AJ's got something else in mind. He sends Theory into the barricade. AJ Styles with a message to send here tonight. A point to prove for the phenomenal one. AJ wants next in line for the WWE Championship. AJ's headed to the top rope. Theory's still on the outside. I don't know what the phenomenal one's got in mind. Referee's at a count of seven right now. But Styles, any means necessary for the victory. Crossbody from the top down to the floor. And Albany, New York, in all of the phenomenal AJ Styles tonight. Styles throwing caution in the wind, all in the means of getting his hand raised in your Raw main event tonight. Look at Austin Theory off back inside the ring we go. Theory able to dodge it. Austin Theory, now you, sell, you see the sense of urgency out of him. Cradling AJ Styles up, and down to the canvas goes Styles. 
And then there's some deep waters in this contest here. Both men throwing some of their best shots at each other. Momentum rides on the line in this one-on-one -on -one affair tonight. And what a brain buster by AJ Styles. Now AJ unloading on Theory. This is vintage AJ Styles inside of the squared circle. And now ahead into the top rope. Theory looking up at the lights here in the arena and a frog splash into the cover. Will that be all she wrote? Not just yet as Theory barely, barely gets that shoulder off the canvas. Momentum rides on the line as we head towards Toronto on January the 1st in the Royal Rumble. Theory on his feet. AJ Styles got something in mind. Sends Austin Theory to the outside again. Styles really utilizing the outside of the ring in this contest. One. Styles not afraid to brawl with the best of them. Pound for pound, one of the best professional wrestlers in the world. Hell, one of the best professional wrestlers of all time is the phenomenal AJ Styles. And he's called just that because of his versatile offense inside of the ring. And AJ's clearly got something in mind on AJ Styles, on Theory right now, but he misses for the crossbody. And Theory counting his lucky stars, he avoided it. And Styles maybe smelling doomsday right now and a power bomb to the outside of the ring. And just like that, the pendulum of momentum shifts in this matchup. And that miss by AJ Styles may have just cost him. Theory back inside the ring. Styles accidentally tripping up the referee there, but now Austin Theory takes advantage of the situation with a backbreaker. And off the just moments after that power bomb on the outside, Styles has got to be feeling it right now. And Theory's unloading. But Styles got the knees up. Styles grabbing a hold. Signature offense. Clothesline takes Theory off his feet. Back and forth we go in your main event tonight on Monday Night Raw. Both men with a swing and a miss, and Styles able to go behind. Takes the legs out from underneath of him. Styles headed out, could be looking for a phenomenal forearm, but Theory able to get to his feet, and Theory on the counter. And now Styles counters and takes out the leg of Austin Theory. Now AJ heading to the apron. Wait a minute, springboard. Phenomenal forearm for the phenomenal one. Into the cover he goes. And a big time victory for AJ Styles here on Monday Night Raw. Back to back L's for Austin Theory inside of the ring. That young man is not gonna be happy on the road to the Royal Rumble. But AJ Styles making a statement here tonight in Albany. Styles wants next for the WWE here Championship. Randy Orton and the entire Monday Night Raw locker room better take focus. Because AJ Styles, a part of Raw once again, has got a new focus on his career. And as we head towards January 1st in the Royal Rumble and the road to WrestleMania, AJ Styles very well may be damn near untouchable inside the squared circle. Hey, so I'm on a chase like that, yeah, I play so strong with a knife in the back, I'm a swing home run like a baseball bat, gonna see me rise, you can hate on that, I don't play both sides, doing me no cap, I'm a rock.